posturing closed guard. Liv's got me in closed guard. Like so. And she's broken my posture. Okay, so if she's got a collar grip, there's a few things I can do. Uh, first of all, get, I'm, I've got posture and Liv gets a collar grip. Nice and deep. Like so. Okay, when this is the case, grab both hands on the lapel and we're going to push as we posture up like that. And then we keep hold of the sleeve because that lets us go straight into our guard pass. Okay, second one, I can't, it's probably a little bit too deep for me to get that going. So what I'm going to do, but her arm's still straight, like that, yeah? So she hasn't managed to pull her elbow down, which is even more dangerous for me, okay? So if her elbow's still straight, but I can't break that grip, I'm going to block the elbow and put my elbow on her hip, like that. So it's dangerous because she's across my neck, like that, with her right hand. So if I block here and keep that space, Take my head underneath, like that. She's no longer across my neck, so she can't choke me with that hand. Okay, so I can just ignore it, or I can go like that to break. Last one, she's actually broken my posture down, like so. Whatever you do from here, do not turn your head that way and expose the free. So you've got one side of your neck free, keep it free. Keep your head down like that until you know you can block the other arm. So I'm gonna block the other arm here, like that, reach to the collar, and then I'm going to stand up, I'm going to punch that collar hard, like so. I'm going to stand all the way up, and put my weight into that collar. Effectively, I'm going to choke Liv. Because I'm choking her, she's only got one hand, and I'm blocking this arm, she's going to have to deal with that hand that's choking her. So she's going to eventually let go, and try and deal with that, and I'm out of the collar grip. Okay. Uh, other grips, Liv might have my head, like that. Whenever someone's got your head, you're going to swim your hand inside, like so, inside, and then we can start to posture up and break away, like that. Um, so you've got an overhook, which is very common, like that. This one, if I just try to pull out, I can actually like go through a bit of a danger zone where they can armbar me, like so. So, I actually want to start to stack in. Anytime I feel an armbar or an omoplata or something coming on, it's almost always a good idea to try and put your head underneath their chin, like that. Okay, at the same time, start posturing forward and driving pressure in, like that. Okay, now that I feel, once I feel that my elbow is a little bit loose, I can block her hip from coming out using my leg, and I can start to posture up and pull my arm, like that. Do it quick, because if it gets caught halfway, you're in trouble.